that is upper mental and lower mental. We have taken the P wave. Now what happens is if I believe the P wave while it was passing through the crust region, its velocity I'm taking here, here I'm taking the density. The P waves are having the maximum velocity when they pass through solid medium. When they were passing through the crust, this P wave was passing through 2.8 density medium. What happens is it's, it's take 6.8 km per second. This is hypothetical example. What is the density here? 2.8. Okay. Now if I assume the upper one is the lightest one as you are going towards the bottom what happens with the density density increases so let's say after 2.8 2.8 2.8 2.9 2 then 2.9 2.9 then it is 3 so what happens is the same would be reflected by the speed of p wave let's say 6.9 kilometer per second and let's say it becomes 7 kilometer per second it is the indication of that the density is increasing so how we came to know that the density also increasing because of the velocity when the p waves were passing through the crust area now what happens is let's say we have arrived in this zone all of sudden now the 3 was the maximum density up to here all of sudden the density increases and this happens to be 4.2 what would be the indication 4.2 all of sudden the velocity will increase let's say 7.8 so this spike is not normal this is normal spikes yes now it means what happened is now you are entering into a completely different medium this is nothing but you are entering into which zone we are entering into the mental